This is bigger than I thought. Yuki! Alright. You know what this is. Just a gentle, gentle. That was so off. Do that again. We have this is an instruction manual. We don't care about this. Oh, now I know why this is heavy. God damn it. Take the box away from me, please. Oh my god. Ah. And that, and that. Oh, oh, mom, no hands. This looks nice. You're gonna see this before I do. Oh That's awesome. Let's see what we have here. Look at this. This is a T thread for a cannon. I didn't even get to choose which one I wanted. I shoot Nikon and Sony. Alright, so we got a T thread for cannon. A nice old big, big flattener. This is uh, an adapter. This is a two inch, 28 millimeter, big old eyepiece. We've got a two inch diagonal. Wow, this is big. And we have this tiny, tiny, tiny finder scope. But that's not why we bought this case. We bought it for this thing. Let me get on the other side and try to get it out. Uh, and also, these dog toys are cool. As you all know, these Pre-120 is uh, quite the popular telescope. A lot of people are using this. Actually, in our own little club, we already have four people with this scope. I'm the fifth. Um, the reason I bought this scope, uh, even though I already have a Celestron Edge HD 8-inch, is I wanted a refractor. I wanted something I didn't want to work with collimation every single time and go out and shoot. I wanted something that's a little bit more grab and go even though this is 10 kilos which is 22 pounds which is more than the Celestron Edge HD. This is still something that's going to be a lot simpler for me to just take and start shooting because all I have to do is really attach my equipment, focus and that's it and I can start shooting. I don't have to bother with collimation. Hopefully this is well collimated and uh, arrived uh, all tuned up from the factory. Unleash the beast. 10 kilograms. This is roughly the same weight as uh, my counterweight for my CEM60, but this feels more. Even though it's the same weight, it feels a lot more. Of course, we all want to see that giant front element. Ooh, how sexy is that looking? All right. Wow. It's not so heavy. <laughs> it is. It is. It's quite heavy. Well, that's all I have. This, this, this is just an unboxing. We have clouds, obviously, so I can't really test it. I'm gonna put the flattener on. Maybe it's gonna be there forever, uh, permanently. And I'm gonna try to see that everything connects, connects nicely, and uh, I'll upload a video when I use this baby. Well, that's all I have really. So, clear skies and have great images in the future.